Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make a moving pixelated image like I just showed you in my intro. So basically the background of that, the pixels are changing colors and they're sort of, it's sort of a cool effect to me. So basically I'm just going to show you how to do that in Motion 5. If you guys are wondering how to do this in Pixelmator, but basically it just stays, this, it's a still image. Uh, I did that tutorial and you guys can click this link to go check it out. But without any further ado, let's get started. All right, guys, so to get started, let's go ahead and open up Pixelmator. Let's create a new document, and it's just going to be a 1920 by 1080 resolution. And this is your standard 1080p resolution. So click OK. And also, if you guys are using any other programs, such as Photoshop or anything, you would just use the same basic concept that I'm using in, in Pixelmator and just apply that to your image. So let's go ahead and first of all, we're just going to click and drag a square onto our scene. And I'm just going to delete our background. So now we want to click and drag that square up to the top left corner over here and make it as big as and make it so it fits the entire screen. All right, now we want to click and we want to right click on our image that we just created and say convert into pixels. All right, now let's go ahead and open up our FX at browser. Mine is already open, but if you don't know where it is, you just go view and it would say show effects right over here. So just say show effects and then it'll show up over here. Now go ahead and click and drag a noise noise filter onto our scene, onto our object that we just created. And I'm just gonna change the amount to about 2%. All right, now let's go ahead and click okay. And now let's export the image as a PNG or whatever you guys wanna use and say next. And our export as, I'm just gonna call mine background image. Now export and replace. All right, now let's go ahead and click X and I'm just gonna delete that. And for now we're gonna go into motion. So click on mo click on our motion right down there and we're gonna cre create a blank motion project. All right, now let's go ahead. I'm just gonna move this to the side and add our background image onto our scene right over there. And now let's fit this scene onto, let's fit this, let's make this scene fit our screen up at the top right corner. And now I'm gonna widen our image so that it's overcorrected a little bit just because when you're pixelizing things, there might be uh, some white dots that show up instead of what you actually wanna see. So I'm overcorrecting just to prevent that from happening. All right, now let's go ahead and, I'm, first of all, I'm just gonna make this a bit bigger and let's go ahead and go into our library over here. And we wanna go to library filters and then we wanna scroll down to pixelate right down there. So click and drag pixelate onto our background image that we just we imported. Now click on pixelate right down there and right down right down in the top right corner, you guys might not, not might not be able to see it because of uh, some video editing that happens, but basically it's right down here here in the top right corner and it looks like three diamond shapes. So click on that down there and we just want to click on animate we've want to animate our pixelation now. So our, in our keyframe editor, we just want to click on pixelate right down here and make sure that's selected. And right over here at the top, it says animated, or it might say something else, but basically you want to click on that and say all. All right, now let's go ahead and for, I'm just going to uncheck mark all those other things except for scale. This is what we want to edit right now. So let's go ahead, double click on the first part of our scale and move it to the beginning. That adds a keyframe and this will be our starting point. So first of all, double click on that and we're going to change the value to be 50. All right, now let's go to the end and add a second dot to the end of it, like so. And now we want to change that value and we want to change it subtle. Or if you want a more uh, drastic pixelation, then you could make it bigger and stuff like that. But basically our value, I'm just going to keep mine at 52. That's way it's sort of a slow, sort of a slow pixelation and it looks nice and smooth. So it's just going to be a value of 52. All right. Now that's pretty much, that's pretty much it. That's how you pixelate an image just to show you guys how it, how it is done. Let me just get it as big as I can and play it. Now, as you can see, it's pixelating throughout the entire scene like that.
Anyway guys, that's it for this tutorial. If you guys enjoyed it, be sure to hit that like button down below. And if you guys want to see more tutorials like this, be sure to subscribe. If you guys want to know more about me, be sure to check out my website and also check me out on Twitter. Anyway guys, that's it for this tutorial and I'll catch you in the next one.